Welcome back to CATS Tutorials. And in this video, we're going to be covering practice problem 2.11. The question asks us to find the equivalent conductance as we look into the circuit from this side or from these terminals. Now, let's have a quick recap from the textbook. G, which is conductance, is the reciprocal of resistance. Right? So, G equivalent will also be the reciprocal of R equivalent. And what does this tell us? So, if you look, we have if R1 is parallel to R2, then we can apply the formula which says R1 times R2. R1 plus R2 to find the equivalent resistance of a parallel connection of resistors. This is what we do. And if we have R1 in series with, with um, R2, then we simply add the two. So just say R1 plus R2. But not, now that we have this relationship, which says conductance, is a reciprocal of resistance. And this is swapped around for conductance. So in this case, we have parallel resistors, and this is how we calculate the equivalent. But for conductance, we apply this formula here. So G1, G2, divided by G1 plus G2. <clears throat> when we have conductances in series. So this is for series conductances. So just say C. And in this case, we have C series resistors, which we simply add. But now in the case of conductances, we apply this G1 plus G2 when we have parallel conductances. So keeping this in mind, let's go ahead and solve the problem which we have here. So I'm just going to switch to new pen. Okay. So we have this node up here and this node down here. So the four Siemens, Siemens, which is the unit for conductance, the four Siemens and the eight Siemens are in parallel. They share two nodes, that node and that node. If we go back here, if we have parallel conductances, we add. So parallel conductances, we add them, G1, G2. So eight, let's, let's write it down up here. So eight Siemens in parallel with four Siemens gives us eight plus four, which is 12 Siemens. And moving down here, we have six Siemens in series with 12 Siemens. So 12 Siemens in series with six Siemens. We give us, we apply this formula now, this formula here. We have series conductances. So apply this formula. It says 12 multiplied by six divided by 12 plus six. So this is 72 divided by 18, which is 4. All right, 4 Siemens. Okay. Then we have, so we've collapsed this part into 4 Siemens. We've collapsed these two into 12 Siemens. We can now draw the new circuit. Drawing the new circuit from our calculations, we have the terminals, we have the 12 Siemens, which we calculated. Then down here, we have, um, we have this node, which is still intact. And we have, furthermore, we have two Siemens. And here we have the um, four Siemens, which we calculated. That's the series connection of those two. So we're looking for G equivalent. So 
what we have now is two Siemens in parallel with two Siemens in parallel with four Siemens. So what we do is simply add four plus two, which is six Siemens. And then now, after doing that, we have 12 up here and we have six, which we just calculated now. And the equivalent or calculating the equivalent from these two is our answer. So this is 12 Siemens in series with six Siemens. So G equivalent will be equals to 12 multiplied by six divided by 12 plus six, which is four Siemens. That is your answer.